Hello, welcome back to ADSR Pro with me, Mike Smith. Uh, we're going to look a little bit more in depth now at the new a multiband compressor in Cubase Pro 8. Um, I recently touched on this uh, briefly in one of my other tutorials, but I thought I'd just spend a little bit more time now uh, just showing you it a little bit more. So I've got a track here, it's really, really rough, uh, nothing, nothing clever. Kind of basic bass, a uh, bit of percussion, drums. Um, so what I've done, basically on the master, uh, I've put the multiband compressor. So let's just put it to So there you go, we'll stick with the dance compressor. So that's it there. Uh, let's just have a little tweak of some of the parameters and, and let's see uh, what this sounds like. So let's just match the volume first of all. So there you go, we've matched the volume there. So now in theory, uh, what we hear will be the, the sound of the compressor working. So we'll leave it on. We'll start with the bottom end. We do that about there, a bit of 2.4 compression. Do that to about two. Threshold. Let's just reset those. Bring the threshold down. Okay. Let's leave that. Let's work on to the next one. Got a couple of dB there. Uh, let's, we don't want to hard limit it like that, so we'll let's try it about that. Be a slightly bit quicker release. So we're bringing that down by just about two and a half. DB. Let's go to the next one. Again, bring the threshold down. Open up the attack. Let's get some of those transients through. Quicker release. Bring them all back in. Let's bypass it again. So you can hear straight uh, straight away there. It's had uh, quite a pleasant effect. Um, I've not done anything uh, too clever there, just sort of tweaked with the parameters a little bit. Uh, the beauty of this now as well, we can also sort of uh, boost the frequency range. You can move the different bands for each section of the compressor. So let's, let's maybe move that one up a little bit. Let's, let's solo this one so we can hear. boost
so there you can hear there you know obviously you can hear there's quite a bit of compression on there pro probably too much um, but you can hear um, it's definitely working it's compressing it's fattening the sound making it a lot tighter uh, plus we're boosting it again you'd probably um, certainly if you were mastering you probably wouldn't boost it anywhere near 5 dB uh, just plus a couple of dB um, but yeah I mean quickly there you, you can see uh, how well that works from before where it was really quite dull and very lifeless There you go that's the new multi-band uh, compressor uh, that comes with Cubase 8 uh, again just another quick little overview but again uh, very useful very similar to many other multi-band compressors out there and to be honest the sound of it uh, just as good so yeah well done Steinberg so that's it for the multi-band compressor if you want to um, subscribe to my my tutorials that'd be amazing so until next time bye bye Pro. Pro.